Hey everyone, I wanted to do a quick tutorial on how you can add your own custom music to Fallout 3 in New Vegas. So what you're going to want to do is locate your game's directory. I have mine both pinned to my quick access. I'm not going to tell you how to get to them. I'm just going to assume that everybody knows where to find it. But what you're going to need now is Audacity. Now I have a link in the description for you guys to download. And once you have that loaded up and installed, bring it up. And you're going to want to choose your track. I'm going to go with Icarus from Red Dead Redemption 2 today because I like the instrumental. It sounds really good. And I'm probably going to use it as my explore track. But what I'm doing here is I'm going to convert it to an MP3 file through this website. I'll also link this below so you can use this. So we're going to quickly download this. These are just ads. Just bl block all that. Ignore that. Now I'm just going to grab, drag it over to Audacity. You can also find it in your downloads. So this is the track here. Now, to find your music tracks in both games, they're in your data, music, and this is where you want to edit your files. So you can pretty much edit anything in the game from like Tranquility Lane from Fallout 3 or to like the public noises and like the audio that's playing when you're in Megaton, for example. But today for today I'm gonna make this an exploration track because I think it sounds good for an explore track as you hear now you can see how it's slightly peaking you kinda want it to remain around minus six decibels because the way Fallout 3 handles sound, you usually never have your music at max because if you were, you would hear the crackling start. I generally keep my music about halfway, so I'm going to actually leave it there because I think it's going to sound perfect and the most balanced. Now I know people, s I'm not entirely sure how this works. People say you have to export it as OGG. I've done this, this is how I do it. It works for me. If it doesn't work for you, please let me know and I'll try to help you out. But I export this as MP3. You want to have it set to 110, 150. You can leave that on fast. They always say you put it into mono. I just leave it on joint stereo like this. Now, the easiest thing to do here, I can't show you, but I have on my desktop my own custom music folder here. Just make your own folder and save it into here for now. Okay. And once this is done exporting, I'm not going to save it. Now, we need to make sure that it matches the same as these. As you see, I've already got some of them done in this folder. So we're just going to name it to explore-11. And then we're just going to drop it into Fallout 3. And then that's actually all you do. And it should just work now. But for other tracks that are a little more complicated, like battle music, for example, you need to have a final so that after the battle's over, it plays a around about a six second ending so that it has something to end off. Because if you don't put a final in, it's basically just the soundtrack and then nothing. And it just makes makes it really awkward. So you need to make sure you also add in a six second final when you do battles. Now for New Vegas, it's a little different. I'm not entirely sure how New Vegas works because Music in New Vegas is broken up, but you can tell this one's Battle, Dungeon, these are locations, these are old as in like old music from the previous games. But I already have this one installed here, which is Western Music Overhaul, so I'm not actually going to edit any of the musics today, but um, hopefully you'll be able to understand that location, these are like their own separate soundtracks. It's really hard to explain, New Vegas is a little different and it's a little more complicated with music because I'm not entirely sure if it's connected to the s certain cells or if it's just this but I'm, al I'm almost certain if you were going to desert exploration these are the main sounds that are f like music tracks that are being played while just exploring the Mojave so if you want to edit these you merely just need to add in your own and just make sure that they have this exact same name but they have, each of them have like highs, lows, mids, which I'm not entirely sure how that works. But 
these are the files to edit and I'm pretty sure if you do do it it should work for the most part so long as you rename all the correct files and you have a mid a low and a medium but I'm not going to edit any of these today if you want to attempt this and let me know how it goes then by all means give it a try okay so now that we've added our custom music we're going to fire up Fallout 3 and we're going to have a listen okay so we're finally in Fallout 3 now seems we've got da -da -da -da. and here's our new track So that's it for today guys, thanks a lot for stopping by and checking this out, I hope this all helps you guys, I really want you guys to be able to customize your own music and your Fallout games, and give it your own personal like touch. So without further ado guys, have a good day and thanks for watching.